Good morning, boys and girls. Good morning. Good morning. I hope you guys are having a wonderful virtual learning day. We're having a little technical issues. I think it's on my side. And we're just going to go with it. And you guys just follow along and check class tag if you have any issues. Okay, you guys? All right, we're going to start with our good morning song. Ready? All right, let's go. Come on, Ian. How are you, Sire? How are you, Elijah? How are you, Jaquan? How are you, Ava? How are you, Anai? How are you, Callie? How are you, Kalia? How are you, Miss McCoy? How are you, Miss Blanton? How are you, Miss Nia? How are you? How are you today? I am doing fine and I hope you are too. I am doing fine and I hope you are too. I am doing fine and I hope you are too. How are you today? Great job, you guys, great job. As you know, this month, our theme is summer. Yes, you know, yesterday we did a summer portrait. You guys drew your favorite activity to do in the summer. Callie, you remember? You said you like to go swimming. Yes. All right, you guys. So now we're going to get into some music and movement. All right. Let's make sure you guys can hear this. McCoy, if you can see it, give me a thumbs up. Okay, all right. YouTube Music Premium is dedicated to you. During your dinner party with friends and family, unlock healthy music for a child's heart, body, and mind. Boom Chicka Boom Summer, available in single song download by The Learning Station. This is a repeat after me song, so make sure you repeat everything I say and do. I said a boom Chicka Boom. I said a boom Chicka Boom. It's summertime Chicka Boom. It's summertime Chicka Boom. It's summertime Chicka Rock a Chicka Rock a Chicka Boom. It's summertime Chicka Rock a Chicka Boom. Uh huh. Uh huh. One more time, bounce a ball style. Bounce a ball, chicka boom. 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 Bounce a ball, chicka rock a chicka rock a chicka boom. Bounce a ball, chicka rock a chicka rock a chicka boom. Uh huh. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. One more time. One more time. Rain dance. Dance in the rain, chicka boom. Oh, 
bubbles, chicka boom. Blowing bubbles, chicka boom. Blowing bubbles, chicka rocka, chicka rocka, chicka boom. Blowing bubbles, chicka rocka, chicka rocka, chicka boom. Oh yeah. Oh All right. yeah. All right. All right. All right. One more time. One, One more time. time. Wait. Look at these bubbles. There's bubbles everywhere. I can't see you. There are so many bubbles. Bubbles. Great job, you guys. Great job, you guys. That was our summer music and movement. Get up and get your body moving, working those muscles, getting excited. So as you know, we have a new start reading, Just Grandma and Me. We read this yesterday in class, and you guys loved it. So what I'm going to do now is share this with you guys. All right. One second. There we go. I can't see the screen. You can't see oh, it? I can now. All right. All right. Let me know if you can't hear it either, okay? Grandma and me. We went to the beach, just grandma and me. Little Critter and his grandma are going to ride the bus to go to the beach. I'm thinking Little Critter is telling the story about his beach adventure. They're going to ride the bus. I wanted to set up the beach umbrella, but the beach umbrella is a covering that is used to keep you out of the sun. Wind was too strong. Little Critter was trying to stick the umbrella into the sand, but the wind was blowing so fast that it blew the umbrella right up into the air. Look at little critter. He is off the ground. It, it blew, the wind was so strong, it blew the umbrella up into the air. I flew my kite instead. Oh no, little critter's kite fell down and landed on the cow's head. Little critter is probably thinking, I hope the cow doesn't get angry with me. I didn't mean for my kite to fall. It was just an accident. It was a mistake. Do you see that kite on cow's head? Oh, she doesn't look very happy though. But it was just an accident. That means he didn't mean to do it. I bought hot dogs for grandma and me, but they fell in the sand, so I washed them off. The hot dogs got sand on them. You can't eat sand. It's inedible. That's why Little Critter had to wash them off to get the sand off of them. Inedible means you can't eat it. See, Little Critter has the hot dog and he's washing it off because it fell in the sand. And sand is inedible. We can't eat sand. I found a nice seashell for grandma, but it was full of a crab. It looks like a crab is living inside of that shell. I bet little critter is afraid that he might get pinched by the crab. A crab is an animal that pinches. Look at little critter. <laughs> he was surprised. He was shocked that there was a crab living inside of that shell. 
and it looks like he's running away. I wanted to blow up my seahorse, but I didn't have enough air, so Grandma helped a little. I told Grandma to take me way out in the deep water, but not too far. I put Little Critter is wearing the float that Grandma blew up. It will help him float on top of the water so that he won't sink down. But Little Critter is still looks afraid. I bet he's glad his grandma is holding him. Float means to stay on top of the water. Look at Little Critter, he looks afraid. But I bet that he's happy that Grandma is holding him. I put on my fins and my mask and showed Grandma how I can snorkel. Fins, you put them on your feet to help you swim. And the mask, you put it on your face so that you can breathe easier under the water. And snorkel means to swim under the water. You see little critter? He has on his fins and there's his mask to help him see under the water. Grandma is still holding on to little critter so he will feel safe in the water. Little critter can't swim by himself. You see grandma holding little critter? She's holding him because he can't swim by himself. And look, he can breathe easily because he has his mask on and he can see under the water. I dug a hole in the sand for grandma, then I covered her up and tickled her toes. Look at grandma laughing. They are having so much fun together at the beach. Look at little critter, he dug this hole and his friends are watching him and then he's tickling grandma's feet and she's laughing. They are having the best time at the beach. I built a sandcastle just for grandma, but a big wave came. Grandma. Sandcastles, well, that's sand that is made into the shape of a castle, a big house where princes and princesses live. Well, that was the sand castle until the big wave came and knocked it down. Little Critter doesn't look very happy, does he? Mama said that's what happens to sand castles and we will build a new one next time. When the big wave of water came, it destroyed it washed away Little Critter's sandcastle. Little Critter looks sad, but Grandma tells him he can build another one. She's trying to make him feel better. <laughs> she looks, you look sad and angry at the same time. On the way home, Grandma was tired, so I told her I would watch for our stop. Grandma must have been exhausted. Exhausted means very tired. Look at little critter. He said his grandma was tired, but he is the one who looks tired. He looks exhausted. Exhausted means very tired. We had a good time at the beach, just Grandma and me. Little Critter was so exhausted, so tired, he didn't even wake up when they got off the bus. His grandma had to carry him to the house from the bus. 
Little Critter had so much fun at the beach with his grandma. Look at grandma carrying Little Critter. He was so exhausted. He couldn't even wake up. And that's just grandma and me. Let's look back. Hmm. We just read about Little Critter and his grandma. Let's look back and see all the things that happened. <gasps> Do you remember what happened here? Yes, Little Critter dropped the hot dogs in the sand and sand is inedible, which means we can't eat it. And now he's washing it off in the water. And that's grandma on him. What about right here? Do you remember what happened? Yes, little critter tried to get this shell for grandma, but there was a crab living in it. And he looked scared. He's running. <laughs> and what about right here? Yes, little critter is tickling grandma's feet and she's laughing. Remember, little critter dug this hole for grandma to get into. And now she's in it and he's tickling her feet. Wow. <laughs> All right, you guys, that's just grandma and me. All right, so. So you guys, remember, our theme this month is summer and our new start book is just grandma and me. All right, so I want you guys to listen out for class tag for our virtual learning activity. I think that today we'll be doing something pertaining to our book, our start read today, just grandma and me. Ms. McCoy, do you have anything you'd like to say? Just that you guys have a great day and we will see you on tomorrow. We will see you guys tomorrow. All Don't right, you guys. Don't forget to check class tag. Don't forget to check class tag. Have a wonderful day. Bye.